All right, as Holly just mentioned, she likes being here so much because we're either wearing a costume or we're drinking. And we're doing both. <laughs> yeah, there are plenty of reasons to party this weekend. Oh, yeah. And here is Brad Yates. He's from Camp Bar. They got Milwaukee, Shorewood, and Tosa. He's going to make a Cinco de Mayo drink um, with a Wisconsin twist. Or is it a Wisconsin drink with a Cinco twist? It's a Cinco twist. Well, it's a camp twist on a Cinco drink, oh. I guess. It's a camp know. twist on a Cinco on a drink. Who Cinco drink old fashioned at camp. So, All right. Yeah. yeah. What you got? What you well, got? What are we doing? We're doing a tequila old fashioned. Okay. What I start off with is oh, tequila uh, old fashioned. Tequila old fashioned. That is a twist. I, I guarantee know. I already like this better. Yeah. yeah. Oh and, yeah. Uh, it's cherry and lemon to start off with, okay. using a little grapefruit bitters. <gasps> Never heard of that. I know. And instead of using sugar that you would in most, I'm using agave, agave oh. syrup, which is from the same plant as. Tequila. Oh. Or Don Julio. <laughs> they really complement each other really well then. They do. I love that. Just you like you two complement each other. Thank Aww. you, Brad. You're muddle gonna it, muddle it up there? Muddle it up. Let's make it nice and pretty. And for Tiffany, lots of tequila. Right? Nice. I got That'll her in trouble get her last better. Year. Yeah, so. <laughs> and you're always getting her in trouble. I know, no shots today. No <laughs> shots, Tiffany. Little ice. Okay. And that, that's it. Give it a shake. Okay. And guess what? What, there we're done? Is. We're done. I like oh my that. Gracious. Oh, does that look good? Oh, it yeah. looks so refreshing, All right, too. I'm going to pass this over to you, Hal, and give it okay. a taste. There you go. There you go. Do it. All right, talk about what's right there, too. Well, we went to Kentucky back in December, and we brought back a... Uh, uh, Moonshine? No, oh. a barrel of bourbon. And uh, we're featuring it, <laughs> and it is wonderful. Oh. Brought a derby cocktail in, because we are celebrating the derby tomorrow, um, along with another cocktail that came from all those. So yeah, we got what two days What is this one right here? That is called the Scoffla. Okay. Scoffla, it's a traditional Kentucky drink, bourbon, um, sweet vermouth. Mm. Yeah. That's yummy. Yeah, Warming. the other one is my favorite. It's called Lost in Danville. And there's a long story, but you'll have to come into camp to get that full story. What's up with the squirrel? We have uh, a squirrel in a derby hat. She has a derby hat on? That's a derby squirrel. That's yeah. a derby, derby squirrel. squirrel. Derby squirrel. <laughs> Yeah, I won't tell you where I made that, but that yeah. was that was my project yesterday. Oh my gosh, that is perfect. Up. Yeah, that is she's she's hanging out with us. She's hanging out. Awesome. Like, you know, I'm gonna have the matching hats today. I think so. we might have to selfie with the derby squirrel. I think so break. too. I think so, so too. And, Great and, to see and, you, Brad. So, for, if people are visiting camp today, uh, tomorrow, ask for these drinks and they'll yeah, make them up. we're doing these on special. The Don Julio. Uh, uh, old fashions today for okay. nine dollars. Tomorrow we're doing Woodford uh, old fashions and mint juleps uh, for, in essence, uh, or in honor of awesome. the derby party. How go. much do these cost? Nine, today? nine bucks tonight. Oh, awesome! They're really That's good. Great. It's so. delicious. It is delicious. And of course, if you go in for the derby too, you can watch it there at mm -hmm. the same time. Right? So there you go. They've got lots of great TVs. Well, I'll be having a little party, dress up, best costume. It'll be a lot of fun. Get tomorrow. fancy. That's yeah. awesome. I love it. You can visit camp in Shorewood, in uh, the Third Ward, in Milwaukee, and Tosa. Yep. Love Absolutely. it when you're here, Brad. Happy Cinco de Mayo and a happy Derby Day. And happy wonderful hat day. Thank you. I you're know. so sweet.